Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a cash stuffing envelope video and it's going to be for my first paycheck of the month. So not much has changed from what I budgeted for. The only thing that has changed is the current leftover. Instead of starting with $116.58, I'm going to start with $12.15 in my um, checking account. But everything else practically stayed the same. I don't know, I haven't received the city bill or the gas bill, so those have not, that's why I left them blank. But for the most part, I am roughly going around what I budgeted for, but I'm just gonna leave them blank, but everything else practically stayed the same. So I'm gonna go ahead and just get this video started with the cash stuffing. I just can't believe how fast this year has been going. Okay. I'm gonna do 20s, 50s, and 100s. Okay, so the first one is my husband's allowance and he gets $100 and we're doing $100 each month instead of doing the normally like $20 each paycheck. It's just gonna be $100 a month. Um, my allowance, I am putting it in the, what is it called? In the, just leaving it and checking and then transfer it to my um, credit card because I'm gonna buy something. Um, and then I started writing it for my allowance but it's actually for fuel. So for fuel, is it fuel? I think I took out fuel and I'm not supposed to. I think it's family fun. Yes, family fun, not fuel. What the heck, family fun. Okay, family fun gets $55, so 50 and a five. And for family fun, oh my gosh, I have 50 bucks. I have not used it up, so and I'm doing 55, I should have checked. Okay, so $55 gets added to Family Fun. So I'm just gonna leave those there. The next one is for Stockpile, and Stockpile gets $30. So 20, 30, $30. Right now. And for Stockpile, I have a couple of ones. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six dollars in ones, but I'm gonna take this and set these aside so I can add it to my one dollar envelope challenge where I'm putting all my one dollar bills. And I'm gonna start fresh with thirty dollars. The next one is Christmas, and Christmas is fifty-five dollars. And I think Christmas did change. I think instead of doing the normally fifty-three dollars, I went up a couple bucks just so that I can finish sooner. And I currently have, where's my phone? Oh my gosh. Where did I put my phone at? That's right here. <laughs> okay, so in Christmas, I so for Christmas, I currently have $13.56. I'm adding $55. That puts me up at $14.11. And my goal, so paycheck number one. My goal is to get to $2,500. So hopefully I get there sooner than December. Which I think I will, but oh my gosh, where is it? Right here. All right. All right. So the next one is back to school and back to school gets $20. $20. And I think for back to school, I am completely done. 
let's see I have 1184 I'm adding $20 that puts it up to 1204 and my goal was to get to 1200 so I am done with this so I'm thinking I'm gonna do one month so start maybe the following years back to school that way I'll be one month I mean one year ahead I'm thinking I would do that maybe one month I'll give extra money and the next month probably added to the mortgage and just be paying it off a little bit so one month will be adding it to the what is it 2022 school year and then another month adding a little bit extra to my or maybe adding it to Christmas that way I can be both done with the Christmas and back to school fun and then I could start for the following year I don't know but that's something that I'm thinking of doing I still don't know yet but I will keep you guys updated with that the next one is house fun and that's 135 so 120 35 and for my house fun for this one it's just little projects DIYs that we want to do or any furniture that I want to buy I'm not keeping it track of it anymore but um, I'm gonna go ahead and count how much money I currently have so I have 20 40 50 60 80 100 20 40 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 86. So $286 I have. And then I'll be adding 135 dollars. So, so yeah. Okay. Um, we did buy some boards and in my Instagram I'll be sharing with you guys we are gonna start building some shelves well some cabinets and some shelves around our TV kind of make it look like a media center so we are doing that so I'll keep you guys I'll share with you guys that in my Instagram stories um, the next one is 52 bingo savings challenge which is $90 so 50 50 70 $90 goes to my 52 savings challenge and if you guys are interested in helping me with this all you have to do is comment down below with the amount of money that you think I should be putting in um, I believe the lowest is $2 and the highest currently is $84 um, but this is it for this oh what the heck no it's not it so this goes into the 52 weeks savings challenge so 50 and then I'm gonna put my 20s in here and I am gonna do a video sharing with you guys um, like a six month period of how much money I have with all these now for my ones I'm gonna go and pull out all the ones that I have so we can update it so for groceries and my envelopes break I think I'm just too hard on sliding them so for my groceries I have two dollars and I already had a couple money left over from my um, stockpile but those are it so I'm putting in a total of one two three four five six seven eight dollars into my one dollar savings challenge holy moly oh my gosh they're all messed up all right so one dollar it is look at this one I wonder how much it is I am gonna count you guys I'm gonna do a six month check-in checkup I guess with my savings challenges I've stopped doing the budget moms I've just been so busy I think once I got moving I don't know but I am trying to get back because it I saved quite a bit from the savings from the budget moms but yeah but this is it for this video comment down below 
Um, if you have any questions, don't forget to subscribe if you want to follow me in this journey. And I will see you next time. Wait, actually, I think I'm going to go ahead. And pull, um, draw for the following week. That way we're ahead of it. So I'm going to go ahead and pull it. Okay, and the number I drew out is Yolanda Reese, and she commented $32, so $32. So Yolanda, thank you so much for helping me um, with my 52 week savings challenge. And this is it for this video, and I'll see you next time, bye.